I am so excited to share this video with you. What an incredible transformation this was. Not just physically, but mentally. How awesome this whole process has been. And the way it brought me and my team closer together. The accountability we found with each other. The push. The love in this awesome Magnum family. But let's talk about the body. I hope you guys are going to love watching the process as I transformed from this to this and had a freaking blast doing it. So as you guys know, I was preparing this whole time for the Mr. Olympia competition weekend in Vegas and this is the weekend. We started off landing an extra day earlier than normal, staying in the Bellagio penthouse suite. Holy smokes, was it freaking beautiful. And I had two massive shoots with two incredible photographers, Harry from LHGFX and Brett Seeley from Seeley Photo. We just had so much fun. These guys are so great. I've been friends with these guys for years. And this beautiful setting inside this Bellagio penthouse was just wild. Got a good night's sleep and then bam, right back at it. The next morning at David Barton Gym, one of my favorite gyms in all of Vegas. Just so high end, so gorgeous, and boom, all of my Magnum athletes coming in smoking shape. This is Penny. Boom, boom, Kenny. What up, Marcus? Mikey, here in Oklahoma City. Marcus, my friend. Hi, Marcus. Jamie here. What's up, Marcus? Hey, Marcus. Justine here. What's up, guys? 19-year-old fitness model Dawson Bear here. You got me all the way pumped up, bro. Hey Marcus, I hope everything's going great. I hope your prep is going great. And I hope you're staying focused. Going back and watching where I was just eight weeks ago, 10 weeks ago, it, it absolutely blows my mind. It makes me feel like I was just starting to work out then. And then seeing where I got to, it was just so fun watching my body change daily and watching my body respond to the weights, to the cardio, to the diet, just being able to stay sharp mentally, being able to come to work every day and still get the job done, staying focused. I'm not the kind of guy that says, oh, I'm low carbonate right now, so I can't do my work. You can't have that attitude. If you've got that attitude of, I'm a write-off for the month, nobody wants to be around you. You can't do that when you're doing these transformations. You're probably going too hard on the cardio. You're probably going too low on the carbs. You don't have to. If you go back and watch my videos, you're gonna see I was eating carbs. I was taking in the calories. I wasn't overdoing it and I was staying focused. Okay, this was one of the craziest shoots of my life. The twins. These guys were so awesome to work with. And you can even see in this video the unique lighting they created, the unique atmosphere they created. These guys are such unique artists. And then the amazing athletes that I got to meet at the Olympia. Getting to train with Corey, this guy is so incredible. What a motivator, incredible trainer. This guy was pushing me. We had such great conversations. To introduce Corey. This guy is a massive, awesome trainer. A trainer to the celebrities and just an all around great guy. I love this guy's uh, mindset, work ethic. Corey, please introduce yourself. Corey Kanye, celebrity trainer. You might have saw me on Revenge by the Tory Kardashian. Michael B. Jordan, I'm responsible for his whole physique. Um, and I'm a former bodybuilder, and now I'm right here at this awesome gym. Man, thank you. Like you said, we definitely have a, a story coming from nothing to something. And just being able to inspire and motivate people all over the world from different backgrounds. Because at the end of the day, all of us go through trouble, but it's not the same. It's the same thing as trouble. It's not about going through, it's about overcoming. Oh, dang. 
solid. Yeah, it's beautiful, man. Thank you. Thank you. And then, of course, getting to spend time with Bradley Castleberry. He, he's such a cool kid. He's so positive. He gets you so fired up, but he's so misunderstood. Man, does the internet give this kid a bad time. If you've never seen him before, or if you have seen him before, try and watch him with fresh eyes. This guy is all about positivity. This guy is about helping others achieve more. On the way you do things, and people are recognizing it, man, and you're gonna understand it when you go put that work in, you get to a certain point, and you gotta think like, oh, what am I gonna go, take this, take that? That's not gonna get you to where you want. That's gonna make you a bigger you or make you lopsided even more. And this guy's quality right here, all day. See this? It work. Every body part, abs, all the abs, tricep, bicep, every part of the body he has, you know what I mean? They're quality. just not big. <laughs> it doesn't matter how big you are. It doesn't matter how big you are. I would way rather be small yeah. and be how I wanna be and feel good and look good than yeah, be big and that, small. Man. It's not even about that, man. So figure out what you want, go get that. This is what he wants, that's why he's out here. But back to my transformation. Wow, I love watching, Whoa, watching these back shots, watching my back develop over the weeks, watching the, the ripples. It is so crazy. I love seeing this and it gets me so fired up to get back in the gym right now. I, I hope you guys get to experience that too where you're watching this going, man, if Marcus can do it, anybody can do it. And I gotta tell you, going to the Olympia, it reminded me so much. There are so many incredible physiques in this industry. So many of them, so many of these people are blessed with incredible genetics. I am not one of those people. So I hope you find me more relatable. If Marcus can do it, so can you. Because I wasn't blessed with great genetics. All I'm sitting here saying is, I want to change my body and I'll do everything I have to. I will work as hard as I need to work to change my body. Definitely number one role model, yeah. He is himself. He has the highest amount of integrity. He is caring and loving and passionate about what he's doing. And at the end of the day, he does treat us all like a family. Okay, so when I think of Marcus as a leader, the word that really comes to mind is inspirational. There's a quote that says that leaders don't tell you what to do, but they show you how to do it. And I think that's it with Marcus. When you talk about fitness, when you talk about bodybuilding, when you talk about nutrition, Marcus shows us what's required to do there. The obvious when you meet someone like Marcus, you see the exterior. He's in shape, he's enthusiastic, he's super excited and has so much energy. But I think what makes Marcus such a good leader is when you really get to know him, you see that he is such a kind, honest, and he loves people. And if you don't have those three qualities, you cannot be a good leader. And it is why I'm so proud to be a part of Magnum and why I will always be a part of Magnum. This is a type of guy who trains as hard, if not harder than his athletes, right? So the reason I joined the team was actually because Marcus reached out to me contacted me, called me on the phone, and we had a deep, in-depth conversation about the future of Magnum, the future of my brand, the future of everything that we're creating as a collective, and it vibes so well because my energy and his energy are like in sync. Like when we get in the gym, it's just like boom, boom, boom. When it's, it's crazy, right? Like when I was on stage at the status model search, the energy up there, like he was just vibing off the crowd, I was vibing off the crowd, like everybody was kind of one. You know what I mean? And that's what Marcus brings to the table. So I'm super, super proud to be a part of the team. I'm really, really looking forward to the next number of years growing in the IFBB Pro League and having Magnum there supporting me all the way. <laughs> okay. This for me is like a, a big brother, right? Uh, he tells you when you f but he's always there to, to actually like show you how to correct that mistake. Three words to describe him would be like uh, genuine, charismatic, and uh, a leader. And if Marcus can do it, so can you. So just get going. Get on the freaking treadmill. Learn more about eating right. Go back and watch some of my other videos. Watch some of these transformation videos so you get to see what I was dealing with all the way along. Dealing with the mental focus that you've got to get focused on. Dealing with the eating right. Dealing with the training right. I'm going through all of this stuff in the transformation because I want to see you transform just like I did. And you don't have to go as far as I did. Maybe it's just to lose the first 10 pounds or maybe it's to lose the last 10 pounds. Whatever you are looking to do, I can help.